in year 12 had been very, very successful. Four of our students have been accepted to the University of New England as the basis of the principal's recommendation scheme. Amanda Newton, Ty Olsen, Dylan Price and Candace Richards. In year 10, there have been awarded to three of our students traineeships in the last couple of days. A traineeship is training on the job while at school, also attaining the HSC. And Matthew Bird has been awarded a traineeship at Clusters in Newcastle as a light vehicle mechanic. Shannon Nightingale has been awarded a heavy vehicle mechanic traineeship at the Boral Company at Mount Thorley. Only two of these were offered to all of the schools in the Hunter Valley. One of them came to Cessna High School. Kira Dodds has been offered a traineeship with Boral based at Tommy Gale in heavy vehicle mechanic. Only two of these also were offered in the Lower Hunter Valley. One of those, the 50%, came to Newcastle, came to Newcastle, my apologies, came to Cessna. We've had lots and lots of success in what is the basis of schooling, teaching and learning. Would you please congratulate our students? And really today is all about recognising those achievements and you are going to see a large number of our students whose achievements will be recognised as we go on. But what I'd like to do is just indulge for a moment about what else makes a good school and what else makes a caring school and what else makes an effective school. And what I've spoken about there are the fundamentals. I'd like to talk now about the icing on the cake. And that's something that Cessna High School excels in. And they're what we call extracurricular activities. Things over and above the curriculum that tend to take place outside of the school and outside of the traditional classroom. And I've broken this down into a few areas. In sports, there have been enormous opportunities for students. There have been gymnastic workshops run by Jenny Coburn. The boys' open cricket was coordinated by Ron Dixon and Nick Johns. The girls' not out knockout tennis. Congratulations to Year 7 for making it through their first year of high school and I've seen many successes this year and I hope to see many more in the upcoming years. Today I'd like to present those awards for outstanding academic achievement. Um, Leo Bridge with steady improvement throughout the year and Leo is actually absent today. Brendan Burke for geography. Jenna Day with PD, Health, PE and Mathematics. Logan Ingram for Mathematics, Design and Technology and Visual Arts. Adam Oxford, the Year Advisors Award for Improvement. Emily Price for English and Language. Casey Waterton, <coughs> PNC Award for Consistent Effort and Application. And Jack Woodward for History, Design and Technology, Science and Music. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Masika. It's always an honour and a privilege to recognise those students that strive to achieve throughout the school year. We should keep in mind though that success and achievement is measured in many small ways. Things like turning up to school each day, greeting people with a smile and a friendly word, and trying your best as often as you can. The following students have tried their best and achieved in the following. The PD Health PE, Science, Design and Technology, Visual Arts, Agriculture and Academic Excellence. Nathan Allen, Mathematics. Anthony Bauer, Geography. Karen Cooper, Dance. Daniel Kurt Smith, Techniques, Wood. Kyle Duncan, Human Movement. Joshua Freeman, PNC Award for Consistent Effort and Application. William Ingle, the Year Advisors Award for Sustained Effort. Ben Johnston, Science. Lacey McMillan, History and English. Joel Moore, Music. 
Alison Perks, Food Technology. Lucy Tattersall, Improvement in English. Tanya Walton, Consistent Effort in Mathematics all year. Gemma Wall, Design and Technology. And Rebecca Wybaugh, Mathematics and Academic Excellence. Congratulations. Thank you, Ms. Nana and Ms. Lewis. Our second musical item is a performance by guitarist Joshua Davy. He will be performing since we met. I'd like to start, first of all, by congratulating all of Year 9 for successfully completing the first part of their school certificate. I know they've uh, started to develop a lot more maturity and they've become more conscious of the role that school plays in preparing them for the workforce. And this is something that will become more evident next year as they prime themselves for work experience. Suddenly the real world moves as a viable option. It's a bit scary for some of them. And these people I know will appreciate that for uh, something that they'll be able to take next year. Okay, the first person is Ellie Ray Anderson for English. Sewing bag on fashion. Michael Bailey, consistent effort and application. Ashley Cocking, PD Health PE. Alana Evans, Year Advisors Award for Consistent Application. Melissa Ford, Food Technology, Child Studies. David Gairdner, Standard Mathematics. Madeline Garland, History. Jessica Green, Consistent Effort throughout the year. Emily Huckfeld, Geography. Ashley Jones, Techniques Wood and Electronics. Gina Kembury, Science, Music, Drama. Megan McCann, Visual Arts. Joan McGay, Techniques Metal. Here. Tegan Maloney, PNC Award for Consistent Effort and Application. Nathan Musgrove, Human Movement, Health and Leisure and Year Advisors Improvement Award. Rebecca O'Neill, Agriculture. Jacinta Reed, Intermediate Mathematics. Wei Kin Su, Commerce, Advanced Mathematics, Computer Studies. And Brooke Thompson, Health and Leisure. I'd like you to congratulate all these students.
towards reaching that goal in 2004. It's hard to imagine that um, this time next year will be my last official um, duty as your advisor to bid them farewell and wish them well in their chosen career or destination in the future. The following students are receiving awards for outstanding academic achievement in a subject and I would ask if you would please hold your applause until the end. Firstly, Katie Lee Bow for Legal Studies. Adam Clements for Geography and Senior Science. Joshua Davy for Music. Leslie Dawson for Life Skills Work Study. Leslie's absent. Luke M. Dean for Information Technology, Metals and Engineering. Natasha Foster, the Year Advisors Award for Sustained Effort. Christy Lee Harrison for Society and Culture. Jacob Hartzell for Geography. Michael Ingle, Retail, Sport, Lifestyle and Recreation. Kylie Lance, General Mathematics and Standard English. Jessica Lang, Advanced English. Kylie McCann, Business Services and Work Study. Sarah Murray, Visual Arts. Sarah's also absent. Luke Patterson, Application and Dedication to Work Experience. <laughs> Ashley Scott, PDHPE, Mathematics Extension 1, Mathematics and Biology. Keith Zacaseris, the PNC Award for Consistent Effort and Application. Joshua Vargas for Physics. Sarah Wilson for Drama. And Jessica Whitehorn for Modern History. Please join me in congratulations. The University of Newcastle Scholarship for Year 11 is awarded to Jessica Lang. The University of Newcastle Scholarship for Year 12 is awarded to Tracy Galloway. Thank you, Mr. Hedges. Year 7, Janet Day. Amy McKenna. <laughs> Dan Carrera. Tyson Roxby. And Jessica Savage. Year 8, Nathan Allen, Tegan Musgrove, Shane Sale, Georgina Whitehead. Year 9, Danielle Duggan. Christopher Wall. Wait a series. Year 10. 
Ma sei mascara. Ogni andare! Dente di resto. Please congratulate each winner as they receive their award and then the their chance they see. I would like to invite Mrs. Chris Walmsley, Principal of Cessna Gates Public School, to present the first two awards. The school award for junior debating goes to Lacey McMillan. Vicky West and Hope and Kathy Play representing Cessna Services Club to present the following four scholarships. Ex Services Club Scholarship, Year 11, 2004, Jessica Davis. Services Club Scholarship, Year 11, 2004, Matthew Musgrove.
School Sporting Boy Bular Sighting, Jessica Jackson. School Sporting Boy Bular Sighting, Ty Austin. This award will be accepted on his, by his dad on his behalf. <laughs>
Hey, Dumbass! Dad. Is it bad? Did you get like oh, E's and N's and. No, I just got D. Hello, girls. We're running out of tape. Alright, more problems than anything with this video. He's complaining again. Say hello, Amy, because you're going to. Hi, Amy. Am I? Say hello. 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 H
liking the video to American Chef Husband? Um, pie. Oh, that's nice. This the Haitian maze. Come on, sir. Oh, that's me. Oh, 
to me. Good hit. Hey, stay like that. God. I just gotta head off your smile. <laughs> put it back on, put it back on. Hum. Hum. <laughs> Are you really sending this to them people? Jen, I don't want to go home. Chloe and all that. Say hello. Oh, that's a beautiful photo. Oh, no, what are you going to do about lunch? Yes. Oh, Come on, Mr. Smash my face. No. There's Matthew. Don't that's what I did to his face because he wouldn't leave me alone. Yeah, Matthew, take, take it off now. I'm leaving now. Because I'm leaving. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, Miss. Finally got out of the school. There goes Aunty Karen and them, I guess. I think it's them. Yeah, it's them. Stick head on the main road. Park. No way, this car. <laughs> I think he's heard.